Hi everyone, my name is Tamara. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel, Easy Glowing Vegan. This channel is for everyone, whether you're vegan or not. I created this channel specifically for those who are transitioning into veganism and maybe don't quite know where to start. Um, it's also for vegans who are maybe junk food vegans and are looking for a little bit more of a whole food plant-based approach to veganism, looking for more of that healthy aspect in their diet now. But it's also for people who are just looking for a little bit more tips and tricks of how to incorporate more healthy food into their diet. Of course, I wish everyone was vegan, but if you're not yet, you're still totally welcome at this channel. Just to tell you a bit about myself, I have been a vegan now for six months. It's not very long, and I'm super new to it myself, but I have totally fallen in love with the lifestyle of veganism. I'm not just plant-based, I am a full-on vegan, which means um, I make sure that none of the products that I use were ha harming animals as well. So I'm a vegan for my health as far as the plant-based approach, but I'm definitely a vegan for the animals as well. So I just wanna make that clarification because a lot of times people don't know the difference between plant-based and vegan. Um, so plant-based is something for your health and maybe you're not concerned with the ethical, or not concerned, but maybe, maybe you're not um, conscious about the ethical treatment of animals in testing, um, in products, and uh, in things like that. So while I am plant-based for my health, I'm also vegan for the world. Um, and so I was a vegetarian for about 10 years um, and my throughout my 20s mostly and then I started eating meat again for a couple of years. I kind of fell back onto the train that we all kind of started off on as this is what everyone else does, this is what's socially acceptable, this is part of the food chain and I just kind of let myself uh, be part of that mindset. However, every time I ate meat, I still kind of felt like something was wrong. I didn't want to be eating the meat. It was there, it was available, and of course it tasted good, but I couldn't justify that as a reason for eating meat. So I kind of went on a kick where I started watching more documentaries, such as Forks Over Knives, Cowspiracy, um, What the Health, um, those will all be linked down below in case you've never heard of them or you've never seen them or maybe you want to freshen up on them again. Um, I'd already seen them once and again I freshened up on them and it really reinvigorated why I was a vegetarian to begin with. Um, but rather than being a vegetarian, I also realized the harm that is in the dairy and fishing industries, which I was really virtually unaware of before. And so after finding that, I went vegan overnight. Um, I went from eating meat to being vegan overnight. I decided that this was just not something I wanted to participate in anymore. I couldn't ethically know these things and participate. Um, and, and so I decided to take back my control of not only my health, but my participation in the world as a whole. So, um, however, why I'm the easy glowing vegan is because the key word is easy. Even though I'm plant-based and ethical and all of those things, everything I do is easy. So all the recipes that you see on this website, everything that I try and talk you through will be easy. If it's not already something that's probably in your pantry, I probably won't use it. I like to use things that I already know what they are. I've already used them before. There might be some things that you're new to or maybe some things you've heard of but just never tried. So I will encourage you to try new things, um, but I don't get fancy. I don't, I just ask that you have a saute pan, a pot, and either a food processor or a blender, something to, to mash those things up. So um, everything I do is, well, for the most part, oil-free, gluten-free, and sugar-free. Um, I don't like to add those things to my food, and so I won't make you add those things to your food either. So what, I'm making this channel because um, throughout my process, as I said, I have become a sponge. There are so many things I've watched, so many things I've learned. Um, a huge inspiration for me, which I forgot to mention, was James Aspie. I'm going to go ahead and link his um, YouTube channel down below as well because it is, I watched some of his videos, and even though I have been a vegetarian for all those years, the things that he was saying about veganism really ignited something in me that was never ignited before. Um, he's very much an activist, but in such a compassionate way. I think a lot of times veganism can be misconstrued and vegans can sometimes seem harsh and 
coming from a place of judgment as as non-vegans think you know and so james aspie really puts it out there in a way that's full of compassion um for everyone because as he states we all were not vegans before well most of us we mostly were not vegans before we became vegans so we all have to start somewhere and a lot of us don't have the knowledge or the understanding so there's no judgment with james aspie and there's no judgment with myself i am here to spread any kind of peaceful message that I can about why to be vegan and uh, how to help you become a vegan. So throughout my process, um, I have joined a lot of groups and I've also found a lot of people have a lot of questions. Um, and because I was a vegetarian for so long and because I have a super passion for health, I was really into holistic health and I've always really had a passion for health. And so I really absorbed this plant-based version of veganism that most people I feel are, 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 are not really familiar with. We're in a world of fast food, processed food, delivery food that most people are not really familiar with staple home-cooked plant-based food and so i want to make that super accessible to everyone because plants are our food they are our healing they are our nourishment they are our medicine and so i really want to incorporate that into your life as well um, and i have so many recipes and ideas i want to share with you um, again plant-based food eating but also ideas um, when it comes to everything from your from some face products to hair products to makeup to uh, clothing I really you know want to be able to share that full-on cruelty free vegan lifestyle with you in whatever extent you want to take it to so I have a lot to cover throughout this channel um, and I'm kind of just summarizing all of that for you now so you know what to expect um, and what else you can expect from my channel is I will have um, cooking. Cooking is a huge part of it. So this video here will showcase um, our recipe of a super healthy, heart healing uh, cauliflower scramble made with some turmeric and some other healing herbs and spices. Um, you can make this for a breakfast, it's perfect for breakfast, or you can also make it for a lunch dish as well. But we're gonna share that with you, show you the recipe for that. Um, so having a cooking demo on that. So you can expect cooking demos from me. Um, next video, I also have a cooking demo over a spinach and artichoke dip. Vegan spinach artichoke dip super tailored to make it super great. So you're gonna love that as well. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be sure to ring, get a ring when uh, that video is uploaded as well. I also wanna do some shopping trips. So I'll take you shopping with me, show you the staples in the kitchen, what you really need at all times, things that are cheap and easy to uh, spice things up, staple vegetables, staple um, grains, things like that, but things to make you be able to, um, again, do this super simple, super quick, and always have what you need on hand. Um, also cheap meal prep. So with the cooking demos, we're also gonna be doing some meal prep ideas. So you can make breakfast and lunch and dinners, um, and it's pretty effortless. If you forget and you don't have time in the morning, I want you to have something ready to go from the night before that you can make up a little bit different and turn it into your lunch now. So um, this is all gonna be super easy and quick and really utilizing all the food you have to make things as cheap as possible. I have saved so much money since becoming vegan. People say that being vegan is expensive. I have saved a ton of money on groceries and dining out now. Um, and so I want you to also have that same knowledge. I'm also gonna do a little bit of a food focus, which means we're gonna pick up pick a food every month. Um, the first one will be dragon fruit. I love dragon fruit. I never had a dragon fruit before coming vegan. Picked one up at Whole Foods one day, and now I'm super obsessed. So we're gonna do all the fun um, benefits of dragon fruit, how it's healing for you, what it does for you, and how you can incorporate it into your diet. And we're gonna do one of those every month with different foods. We're also be doing interviews with vegans and non-vegans, maybe even some other YouTubers, um, and just kind of get some conversations going and things like that. And also definitely some frequently asked questions about veganism. So if you have questions, please comment them in the question section or the comment section below so I can answer those for you during my next video or throughout this segment. I might even make a whole segment on your questions. So please feel free to be interactive and I will interact with you. And I look forward to more videos with you as well. Thank you again for tuning in to Easy Glowing Vegan and I hope you have yourself an easy glowing day.